Hello, my name is Jeremiah Cornelson, and I am a summer student at the Transcona Museum, and I'm here to talk to you today about my top five most underrated artifacts here at the museum. Get right into it. Number five on my list is a felt Boy Scout troop leader hat uh, that was donated to the museum in 1989. It's made of felt and is handmade. Um, it's a simple yet historic artifact. I think that this scout hat is an important and underrated artifact due to the impact that Boy Scouts have on communities like Transcona. At number four, we have a vintage pocket watch made of brass that was donated to the museum in 1991. Connected to, to the pocket watch via a chain uh, is what looks to be a large ornate looking topaz as, as well as its one of a kind look um, makes it in my mind cool and underrated um, because of its possibility that it could have been owned by someone powerful um, back in the day. Uh, that's just a guess but maybe. Next on the list at number three is a vintage nutmeg grater that was donated to the museum in 1968. I think this is a super cool item. Uh, I've never seen anything like it before and it is obviously super old school. Um, you would place the nutmeg in between the serrated edge and the spring and scrape the nutmeg on the serrated edge to grate fresh nutmeg over your food. Uh, I really love its design um, and it's super old and I'd never seen anything like it before so that's where it, why it makes the list at number three. To number two on our list we see a uh, flag of the Republic of China circa 1945. Um, this flag was hung outside of the Eaton Center in downtown Winnipeg along with flags from all of the allied countries during the Second World War. Um, it, they were hung out there to drum up support for Canada's allies during the war and to make sure that everyone knew that it wasn't just Canada fighting in the war. This currently serves as the flag of Taiwan today, but in 1945, this was what was the Republic of China's national flag. We get to number one, which is possibly the weirdest and definitely the most underrated artifact we have here at the Transcona Museum. It is a beluga whale fetus in a jar uh, stored in a 70% ethanol solution. Um, it is a complete beluga whale fetus as well. In the jar, there is an unidentified heart. Um, this artifact was part of the C.S. Patterson collection. Um, when the formaldehyde in the original jar was getting low um, during those tours, the Manitoba Museum was kind enough to replace the old formaldehyde with the now ethanol solution. Um, this is a very unique artifact to a small community museum like the Transcona Museum. Um, it's very odd. We do not know where it came from or when it came into the museum other than it was inventoried in 2007 along with a bunch of other artifacts from the C.S. Patterson collection. So that concludes my top five underrated artifacts at the Transcona Museum. Thank you so much for watching. Please visit our website if you have any questions about our hours or location and to see more information on these artifacts and more. You can also visit us on social media, Instagram at Transcona Museum, Twitter at Transcona Museum, and Facebook under Transcona Space Museum. Thank you so much for watching again. Subscribe and we'll see you again some other time.